This is Dromore, County Tyrone, nine miles southwest of Oma and 16 miles from Enniskillen. In this part of the world, football is everything, and the people are relishing the challenge of facing Mayo. Depends if the local club man, Cahill McYarn, can stop Kellen O'Connor. Could be make a difference. I think they will improve and I think they'll lift their game. They certainly won't be beaten for lack of effort. Dromore's best known footballer, of course, is this man. Three times an All-Ireland medalist, Ryan McMenamin. You've got 15 men really working really hard together. Maybe they were written off at the start of the year against Donegal. and They've got an All-Ireland semi-final, which probably a lot of the pundits didn't predict they would. And they're there and they're there in merit. Meanwhile, in Ballyhonas County Mayo, people on the streets... Oh, they'll win by four or five points with the help of God next day. And people on local radio are just talking about the big match next Sunday. Sense, and I think they're able to take that kind of pressure now. Mayo's performances have been very impressive so far, but the team members realise Tyrone will provide their biggest test. Mickey Hart had them well drills. You know, they've an awful lot of experience there. There's a lot of lads there with two or three Ireland medals in their back pockets. It's going to be a really, really hard, hard game for Mayo. I think Tyrone, they're going to find that it's a really hard game for them as well. And the winners of them are going to go into, the, going to go into an All-Ireland final with great confidence. This is Mayo's third All-Ireland semi-final in a row and Tyrone's first since 2009. The word all over County Mayo is, there's going to be nobody home. They're all heading to Croke Park. The only three to mind the county are these three. Marty Morrissey, RT News, Valley Harness, County Mayo.